Words from Psalm 36. Lord, you embrace all life. How we prize your tender mercy. God, your people seek shelter, safe in the warmth of your wings. They feast at your full table, slake their thirst in your cool stream. For you are the fount of life. You give us light and we see. Grant mercy always to your own. Victory to honest hearts. As you enter into prayer today, take a moment to be still. Come into God's presence with a deep desire to meet with God now. Know that God is the God who sees you and that God is looking at you now with great love. O oh God, the fountain and source of everlasting life, in your light we see light. Increase in us the brightness of knowledge, that we may be lightened with the radiance of your wisdom. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Today is Mothering Sunday. The Gospel reading presents us with the care and concern Jesus has for his mother, even as he dies on the cross. It is profoundly moving that mercy and compassion are still at the absolute centre. Mothering Sunday, almost uniquely in the United Kingdom, on the fourth Sunday of Lent, invites us each year to reflect on our care for one another in our families and communities, to build up our common life so that all are welcome and the needs of each other are met. So the Gospel reading from John. Chapter 19, verses 25b to 27. And that is what the soldiers did. Meanwhile, standing near the cross of Jesus were his mother and his mother's sister, Mary, the wife of Cleopas, and Mary Magdalene. When Jesus saw his mother, and the disciple whom he loved standing beside her. He said to his mother, Woman, here is your son. Then he said to the disciple, Here is your mother. And from that hour, the disciple took her into his own home. Spend some time reflecting on this Gospel reading from John chapter 19. Mull it over. Ask God what God wants you to hear today. And offer your personal prayers and thanks for the day to God in a spirit of gratitude and thanksgiving. So 
So we conclude with the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen.